optimal classroom conditions and basically at the start of the year you're looking to set up your optimal conditions and a good setting is a definite one that we need for every classroom now there's two areas we're going to be sitting in either on the carpet in front of the interactive whiteboard or every area or mainly at your desk so we'll look at it on the carpet first very simple um, to do good sitting in the carpet you must put your bottom in the carpet obviously um, face forward um, face the front or face the presenter cross your legs and put your hands in your a We'll then look at it in the chair. So to do it in a chair, you must put your bottom on the chair, obviously. Face the front once again. Keep all legs on the floor, including your own, and pull your chair in behind your desk. These then allow us to do good listening. And to do good listening, you must keep your hands still. Look at the speaker, obviously, if you're facing front or facing the presenter, you be doing that. Hear what is said and think about it. I would also put a number of posters around the classroom with pictures of the children doing this so that they know what the optimal conditions are and also um, encourage them on a number of occasions to practice this. Particularly at the start of the year, it's good to practice it because uh, it embeds it into our learning and makes it part of the classroom routine and a part of our base camp a preparation for our expedition throughout the year of learning.